Welcome back everyone, Jen here. Today we are gonna go for a walk through Home Hardware, which is a Canadian hardware store and we're gonna look at amazing Christmas goodies today. I haven't been into a hardware store for ages. I needed to run in and grab something. I'm just trying to limit my shopping trips these days because I honestly don't enjoy shopping at all anymore. So I had to run in and grab something and they had beautiful, beautiful Christmas stuff out. So I wanted to film it and share it with you guys. Home hardware definitely does not need to be overlooked when it comes to their Christmas decor. They get beautiful, beautiful decor, especially if you're into that whole farmhouse vibe like I am myself, the rustic, they get gorgeous items. Check out these beautiful, beautiful Christmas baubles. Little decorations for the tree. Of course, the gnomes. I mean, we all know that the gnomes are super popular. Love that Merry Christmas sign. They have a lot of wildlife. These galvanized trees were very beautiful as well on the wooden bases. Santa. Lots of snow globes as well. These would be beautiful gifts to give somebody. Look at that wooden sled. It's like an old toboggan. I love that. Some absolutely beautiful signs for the wall. Peace on earth. May your days be merry and bright. I really like that white barn in the background. Usually you see the red barn in the background. But the only red on here was the cardinal in the tree. Very well done. This one was super traditional looking. There was a lot of signs. I could not believe it. Lots of oven mitts and pot holders and tablecloths, placemats. I honestly didn't know Home Hardware carried this much Christmas stuff until the past couple years. And they seem to really, really be expanding. They even had garden flags. I love that reindeer sign up there as well with them antlers. This one was gorgeous in an old window frame with all the birds. I love birds. There was a male and female cardinal here. Of course there was lots of red truck finds throughout the store as well. I noticed that. Read up on the trends. But I'm just loving all the wood tones, the neutral, and the galvanized these next couple of signs were some standouts to me. They were just some of my absolute favorites. I love how they use the different textures. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. It, is that like an old light bulb on there? I think that's fabulous. A beautiful water dome, snow globe. And this one was definitely my favorite. but it's not all about the presents. <laughs> These big metal tags were gorgeous. I really like that sign up above there, but I just didn't like the saying on it. And then these were really nice. Huge, huge ornaments. The camera's not showing the size. And this present set was a set of three with the trendy black and red print on it. Gorgeous, they were glittered. Oh, I love those. An advent Christmas countdown, some beautiful bows. They had all kinds of ornaments. They did have trees up on display. It was just really hard to film everything. I tried my best to get a good variety, but it was getting quite busy in the store. A pink unicorn. I think that's fabulous if you had a little girl. These were beautiful also. So many different textures and different elements this year. Lots of pastels are trending this Christmas, I've noticed. That red lantern was gorgeous. All these little reindeer. Home Hardware is definitely a Canadian hardware store here in Canada. Beautiful, great big blow-ups. Here's a gorgeous red truck with a, a snow-covered it looked like a flock Christmas tree in the back. Beautiful lanterns, more presents. 
it literally went on and on. This was another standout to me, a big, huge, rusty looking bucket, farm fresh Christmas trees on a stand. That is amazing. And I love this as well. It's like a miniature door, farmhouse door with the wreath there in the center. This big deer was beautiful also. They had this in a couple different colors. There was blue, gold, silver, red. These stockings were lovely. Very neutral. But I liked all the different textures. I mean, just look at some of this. I think this picture right here that looks like wood with the moose and the deer in the background, I believe it lit up and then they had a version with trees and deer as well. All kinds of pre-made wreaths and garlands and beautiful bouquets that you could put together and make your own planters. And then they had all the items sold separately. So if you wanted to do your own wreaths and garlands, you could buy the items and customize and make your own. Here's some really nice pink and gold ornaments. Those were large, large containers of ornaments. Look at those beautiful cardinal ornaments. Oh, I love them so much. They are stunning. All kinds of wooden crates for sale. Now they also had a great big display or a basket, I guess it was, filled with all these pine cones in different colors and these were scented. They smelled so good. I could smell them even with my mask on all throughout the store. This was really nice too. And I'm not someone who normally goes for moose decor or faux fur, but I really was drawn to these. Maybe it was just more of the rustic element to them. The colors, they had a great big table runner and stockings to match. A lot of their decor I really like because it's not overly Christmas per se. It's very wintry, so you could leave most of this out throughout Christmas, throughout the holidays, and then all throughout the winter months. This was really cute. It was a great big gingerbread looking choo-choo train. Pretty adorable. And I really liked this as well. It looked like a big shuttery window type thing, and that greenery on there almost looks a bit like mistletoe. Oh, it's just so pretty. I love that big reindeer. It's not Rudolph though. <laughs> Some trees were just starting to come out. Now these were more of the miniature trees and I don't know what's going on. Look at this tree. That does not appeal to me at all. And then they had a pink one that was flocked with pink. Something new, something different. I haven't seen that before either. Might be nice for a little girl's room though. And some more big blow ups. These are always so fun. Kids love these. And big kids too. I love that flamingo. And there's the Grinch. And that's it for this walkthrough at Home Hardware. I hope you enjoyed. I just thought this would be fun and something different to share. Have a wonderful rest of your day, everyone. If you're new, I'd love for you to subscribe and join my lovely YouTube community. Signing off, sending you all good vibes and positivity, and I will catch you all in the next one.